This is an eastern mud turtle, Kynosternum subrubrum subrubrum, and uh, this one happens to be a female turtle. We can tell because it has a little bit longer claw and a very, very, very short tail back here at the back. Um, this is very distinct from the musk turtle that we have in our area. And you can see it has a triangular scoot right here. This is called a pectoral scoot. So this triangular one differentiates it from the musk turtle, which has a square pectoral scoot. You can see it's a beautiful color, brown, little tan, sh shades of tan around. These do have claws. They are a mud turtle, so we do find them in mud. So they crawl at the bottom and search for food. They do like to eat a wide variety of things like tadpoles and worms and really probably carrion, anything they can get that's uh, dead. These little claws are pretty sharp, so you can see I'm kind of holding it back right there. I am careful about its head though, because it does have a little, a little beak right there that if it uh, grabs a hold of you, it will pinch. So it's a beautiful female. I just kind of turned it around so you can see it. So you can see it has little nostrils at the top that it can use to breathe air while it's swimming. They can swim and they can crawl on the bottom of the, of the water. Um, this top shell is called the carapace and the bottom shell is called the plastron. And these are like scale-like little, oh, it tries to get me. Look at that. So you want to be real careful you don't get nipped with this particular um, this particular turtle because it will pinch. But these are like scoots. They're like little scale-like um, uh, parts on the top of it that protect it. And in between there is some skin there. So this is called the eastern mud turtle. And uh, isn't she gorgeous? So she's stretching her neck out and really posing for you so you can see her really well. Um, it does have a leech on the side of its head. I can see right there. So that little leech is crawling over and it does like to feed on on the animal's blood there you can see the beak really well and it has a little tongue right there that you can see maybe if we can get the camera angle in there we can see a little tongue in there so these are pretty grumpy you can see it's trying to grab me and i have to be real careful of how i uh of how i hold it because it's a grumpy little turtle but these are survivors and uh i can't tell the age of this because i can't count the rings the annuli or the rings on the side but uh, this looks like a pretty old female. She looks nice and healthy, has a little algae growing back here, but I don't see any damage on the shell, and uh, just looks like, like a nice, healthy turtle. Um, these do get run over on the road, unfortunately, when they go up to lay eggs. I am gonna try to feel for eggs. She's not very cooperative, but sometimes you can stick your finger in there and feel eggs, um, but she may have already laid them. So this is the Eastern Mud Turtle, and isn't she gorgeous?